told us that she was out there just by a dog. What? And you just believed her? You should have put her out of her misery right there. Dog bite my ass. Hey! <laughs> Lucky my nephew can't shoot for shit. Whoa! Whoa! What the you fuck? You idiot! Every lurker for five miles probably heard You're the that. one telling me to fucking shoot her. Everybody just calm down for a second. Clementine, you okay? She tried to run, man. Well, Nick, can you really fucking blame her? We got a doctor right here, okay? He'll have a look. Now what the hell is wrong with you people? Okay, she's just scared. We're all scared, Luke. Don't act like we're the ones being irrational because we don't buy this bullshit story. No way she survived out here on her own. Why are we even arguing about this? Let me take a look. <sighs> it's okay. Go ahead, he's a doctor. Must have hurt. Hmm. Whatever it was, it got you good. This isn't how we do things, man. When you're bit, you get put down. End of story. I'm not going through this again. No one's suggesting that. We could take her arm off. <gasps> I know that worked for a cousin down in Ainsworth. We could try that. It won't do any good. You'll just be making it worse for the girl. It's crazy. No one's going to volunteer to do that. I would. It would be to save her life. You're going to have a kid soon, right? What if I was your daughter? That's the point, kid. You ain't. I ain't falling for that shit, little girl. If it was up to me, you'd be dead already. Who's she? Sarah. What I say, stay inside. It really, really hurts. And it's only gonna get worse. A dog, you say? Do you think it could have had rabies? Out here? Who knows? Right now, that's the least of your concerns. Don't look to me, girl. I want nothing to do with you. So, what do you think? Was it a lurker? A bite like that? Could be anything. Only one way to find out. How? We wait. What? By tomorrow morning, if the fever set in, we'll know if she's gonna turn. In the meantime, we can lock her in the shed. What about my arm? It needs to get cleaned and, and stitched and bandaged. The girl is in bad shape, Carlos. We have all that stuff inside the cabin. We could probably get by with it. Alvin, please. But, yeah, we can't do nothing. I'm not wasting supplies on a lurker bite. If it turns out you're telling the truth, I'll clean it and stitch it up for you in the morning. But... I'm sorry. It's the best we're gonna get. Finger off the trigger, son. I ain't your son. Don't be like that, man. It's all right. Boy's got his mom's temper. Come on. This is just a waste of time. You'll see. And when she turns, I ain't gonna be the one cleaning up the ship. It was a dog. You'll see. I guess we'll find out in the morning. If I last that long, maybe you could go look for it? I wish I could. I really do, but it's too risky. Sorry. Why are we doing this? Fucking dumb. 
Because it's safer this way, then I'd rather be sure. Yeah, it's safer. <sighs> I can't believe this. Not much left in here. I guess if I have to, I can use this for stitches. Stitches. It makes me feel like a fucking idiot when we're not on the same page. We are on the same page. Not out there, we weren't. Not about the girl. I saw you get soft. What do you want me to do, Beck? Put a bullet in her? I want you to think about our family first. It's all I think about. So don't give me this shit. I need some air. me in the shed because you got bit will you please help me i need to fix my arm are you out of your mind even if you ain't bitten by some lurker which you probably are you can't be here you gotta get out of here you understand get back into that shed and carlos will take care of you in the morning you just let me die i wouldn't let you do nothing it's not my call we're a group but you could help and if you don't isn't that the same i don't know all right I'm serious. You need to get out of here. I saw when everyone was arguing. You wanted to help. You didn't see anything. Look, you gotta get out of here before my wife finds you. I'm serious. You gotta go. I got enough problems already. I got a baby on the way. Rebecca's all emotional. Got a mess of hormones causing all sorts of trouble. I don't need any more. Get it? Now go. Please help. Please. Don't cry. I'm not gonna cry. I'm just... tired. You're not with Carver. No. And you didn't get bit by a dead person. No. I'll do anything I can to help your situation. Anything. Except leave me alone. Yeah, I guess. I'm screwed if anyone finds out I did this. You understand? Yes. What do you need? The, bu the cut on my arm needs to be cleaned and stitched. 
Stitch? I ain't doing that. I'll figure it out on my own. All right, look. I don't know what I can find. We're short on bandages, but I might be able to find something clean that will work. I need something to clean it out with. And a needle and thread could help, too. I don't even know where to look. Carlos has medical supplies on lockdown. And we don't got much these days. Well, whatever you can get, I'll find the rest on my own. Okay, wait here. I found you some bandages. And I, uh, I got you a juice box in case you're thirsty. Thank you. Alvin, house meeting in five minutes. Oh, okay, thanks. Now you need to go. Well, Luke has more to say, I guess. Where's Sarah? She's got her book. She doesn't need to be a part of it.
it's clean. I'll still need something to keep it from getting infected. That man sometimes. need to have this baby. <laughs> You're not supposed to be in here. I can be anywhere I want. Go away and don't tell anyone or else. Get it? I... Yeah, okay. I'm sorry, I won't say anything. I'm sorry. I just thought maybe we could be friends. Please don't tell my dad I talked to you. What will he do? Get mad at me. What does he do when he gets mad? He gets angry, and he says he's disappointed in me. And then he just loves me and wants me to be safe. That's it? Nothing else? Yeah. It's the worst. What happened to you? A dog bit me. Sounds scary. I bet it hurt. if I don't take care of it. Do you understand? I just need something to clean it with. I bet it would be with the rest of your medical supplies. Yeah, it is. I'll help you. Good. Thank you. I'm Sarah. You should be in bed, don't you think? It's the only place with enough light to read my book. Please don't tell my dad. Sure. We're friends. Right? We can be best friends. I haven't met another girl my age since way before. It's hard to be the only girl, you know? Rebecca is okay, but she's old. And that's it. And if her baby is a girl, it'll be forever before she's old enough to, like, be my friend. And then I'll be super old. Cool. We just met. We're not friends. But we could be. It's hard to have friends you can trust. Which is why we should be. Come on. Please. I'm worried about saying I'll be your friend, and then having to do something not friendly. Come on. Please. No. No, I'm sorry. It wouldn't be honest. What? Why not? We just can't be. Fine, then. I help you? Will you leave me alone? I don't want to get in trouble. I'll get the stuff my dad uses when I get a cut. I think this is it. That'll work. You can't do it here, though. Someone will find you. Don't worry. I won't. <laughs> 